lot of times we're asked how to draw the ball. Now the one thing I want you to understand is there's a lot of difference between a draw and a hook. A draw is nothing but a perfectly straight ball that falls left. A hook would be a big curve. So we're talking about draws and how you do that is very simply. You don't alter your golf swing at all. You simply alter the feet in, in the golf swing and the way you set up you change your, your, the line your feet are on. Your hips and shoulders still stay square. Now if we look here and we look, I'm going to start the ball 10 yards to the right of the target simply because that's how much I want to draw it. So when I set up to the ball, the, the, I'm lining the blade and the club 10 yards to the right of the target. My feet and my hips and my shoulders and my legs are all on a line right at the flag. Obviously, it, obviously, if I was lining at the flag, my body would be left of the flag if I was aiming the ball at the flag. But in this position here, all I would simply do is drop my right foot back which would make me take the club more on the inside path, which would make me come a little more from inside out when I released it, and it would get the ball just to kind of turn over and fall left. It's a very simple procedure. You don't alter anything other than you leave your hips and shoulders square and you drop the foot back. All that does is get you behind it so you can release the club down the line and the ball will have a slight draw to it. But remember now, hooks and draws are different. You can control a draw because it only falls left. You can't control a hook because it's a big curve.